This animation is about the anti-parallel nature of DNA. First, let's have a look at a single piece of DNA. It has a sugar phosphate backbone where four different possible bases are attached to. Nucleotide is another way of describing these bases. G represents guanine, C represents cytosine, A represents adenine, and T represents thymine. The point that I want to get across in this animation is the anti-parallel nature of DNA, meaning that when DNA pairs to the opposing DNA strand, the two strands run in opposite directions. So if you have a look at this strand, we are going from phosphate sugar attaching a base, phosphate sugar attaching a base, and so on down the remainder of the strand. The strand that this attaches to actually runs in the opposite direction. So a G, guanine, in DNA pairs with a C, cytosine, and it attaches in the opposite direction to the original strand. So you can see this sugar phosphate backbone building in a way that are anti-parallel. So one strand is running 5' prime down to 3', prime, where the base pairs are attached to a strand that are running in the opposite direction starting at the bottom 5' prime and running up the 3' prime direction. So if you were to look at the sugar phosphate backbone on that second strand that appeared, it's actually upside down, so running in the opposite direction. And in each case, a G pairs with a C, and a T pairs with an A.